All right, we're taking a closer look at tonight at accusations against the mayor of Carmel. The city's clerk, uh, treasurer, Christine Pauley, is accusing Mayor Jim Brainerd of inappropriate behavior and creating a hostile work environment. Her attorney spoke with News 8 today before the city council held a meeting to investigate Pauley's firing as an employee. News 8's Julia Dang is here now with new details about this allegation. Yeah, and Mike, we are talking about allegations stemming from events that happened three years ago. And with the upcoming primary election, the timing may appear to be politically motivated. Christine Pauley's attorney even admitted that. But he says she wants the people of Carmel to know who they're voting for. In his statement to News 8, his client, Pauley, accused Mayor Jim Brainerd of creating a toxic work environment. She added he encouraged her to do things she did not want to do. Her attorney provided a copy of a 2016 email from Brainerd to Polly detailing plans for a secret getaway to Rome. Another email to Polly that appears to be from Brainerd's personal AOL account included an attachment. It was an image showing an ad for adult toys. A Carmel City rep says she is aware of both emails. She called the adult ad Brainerd's idea of a joke. She maintains he only emailed Polly about Rome after she showed interest in him and the trip. When you come in and you try two weeks before an election to sway people of an opinion and then act as if you weren't any part of that relationship and had no interest, that's just false. What she's saying is that this is the kind of person that is running for mayor. Is this political? Of course it's political. To News 8, Brainerd called Polly's allegations a premeditated political attack. He added he had a mutual and equal relationship with Polly at the end of 2015 after he was legally separated from his wife. In Polly's statement, she claims she never dated him. The city of Carmel maintains Polly is not the victim of retaliation, and the meeting held today to investigate her firing of the director of internal controls had nothing to do with her allegations against the mayor. Live in the studio, Julia Dang, Wish TV, News 8.